Okay, we're going to do the Exarvin series. We're going to look for layers within the solar profile and describe what we find, maybe classify them as horizons. We'll do that by looking for differences in color and consistency. Consistency would be aggregation, shape, type, and maybe even texture, if we can tell that, just visual determination of the layers present. So let's go to the soil core we have mounted here. It's a monolith, and we've got a very nicely undisturbed soil profile here. At the surface, we have a highly granulated structure and lots of roots in that topsoil. So I'm going to give the very top layer a surface topsoil horizon going from here down to about a color change and a consistency change right about 18 centimeters. That's cutting it a little long, but I think we would call that the first topsoil horizon. Now moving down below that, we'll see the granulation and the aggregates uh, are still kind of blocky and granulated like the topsoil, but they're getting a little larger. The color is also getting a, a little lighter. So we're going to call this a transitional horizon from 18 to, oh, I think that goes all the way down to around 27, right about here. So I might call that a AB or a BA. If I was able to break this apart and handle it, we might get a little better idea of which way to call that. But we'll call the boundary about 27. Moving on down from there, we have some cracking. And that's going to be an indication of clay accumulation. Shrink swell clays contract when they dry. And that's what this cracking is due to. So from the top of that subsoil horizon down to Oh, about 41 centimeters is going to be the top layer of the subsoil. And then down below that, we still have a little bit of clay accumulation, and we have a transition from the rather fine blocky into much larger aggregates and a less porous looking composition down here. So light from 41 down to, I'm going to call that at 64 as a second subsoil horizon. And then continuing down from there, we're fairly uniform in the type of aggregates and the color, all the way down to just past 80, about 83. Then we have a fairly distinct boundary here. And I think we're probably going to be getting into the lower end of the subsoil and grading into parent material here. So this would be uh, either the final subsoil horizon from 83 down to, oh, probably all the way to the bottom of the core here. Transitional, maybe a BC type horizon into the parent material. So this is the exarbon soil profile. Fine example. In review, the topsoil went from 0 to not quite 20 centimeters. At 18, I called it. And then we had a transitional horizon from 18 to not quite 30. And then we have definite subsoil beginning in that range, 27 to 30 range. And the first layer we had down to extending all the way to 64. Oh, I missed one here. We had the first layer here from 41, and then the second one from 41 to 64. and. Then the final one from 64 to about 83, 85, that region. Fairly distinct boundary. And then we have transitioning into parent material, the lower subsoil on down. That's the Exarbon series.